And so spirit is something that reveals the value of things. And I just found a way of taking physical, material things and discovering what is their spiritual essence and then combining those two things together until I have spiritual technology. Welcome, thoughtful viewers, to Science and Spirituality on Supreme Master Television. Today's show features part two of our interview with the vibrant Don Estes, innovator and founder of InnerSense Incorporated. InnerSense, a company based in the United States, studies the effects of different types of vibrations on the human organism and develops technologies to apply and use these effects. Mr. Estes says he has created transformational technologies to help people move from their current state of being to a more highly elevated self. Music, sound, light, and the essence of human beings are all vibrational in nature, and Don Estes' Vibrasound system uses vibrations to help people relax, heal their bodies, expand their minds, and enhance their constructive qualities within. With InnerSense's Harmonic Resolution Therapy, a form of biofeedback, Mr. Estes' goal is to induce change in people so that they can reach their full potential and find their life's purpose. It all comes yeah. down basically to vibrational science and the fact that uh, when we were in high school and when they were trying to teach us trigonometry, they didn't really quite understand uh, the uh, essence of the mathematics that they were using. And actually trigonometry turns out to be a type of math that describes the triune nature of reality, where you always have two opposites of any given thing, but then there's a third position that resolves the difference between those two opposites. And you'll remember the terms sine wave and cosine right. wave and hypotenuse, but they never really told us exactly what those were. But using a supercomputer, we've been able to determine what those actually are. The, the sine wave is the part of the wave that comes from the instrument, whereas the cosine wave is the part of the wave that comes from the player of the instrument. The third position, what Mr. Estes calls the complex, is composed of the real and the potential as assembled by the mind. However, this is not a truly harmonious state, so his therapy seeks to help clients resolve the difference between the actual and potential. The therapy begins with voice or aspiration analysis. Mr. Estes says that by listening to signals based on this analysis, clients can be put back into balance. We actually have the same frequency in each year, but they're out of phase with each other. This one's carrying the cosine wave and this one's carrying the sine wave. So they're out of phase with each other and the brain has to resolve that phase difference. And that's called binaural phasing instead of binaural beating. So whatever the two ears are here, it have to be shared across the co corpus callosum between the brain. And it basically results in some kind of whole brain synchrony of asking the brain to resolve the difference between these two signals, one from the left side and one from the right side. Harmonic resolution therapy involves multiple components that together help bring about full transformation in a person. There are three main sensory mechanisms. Uh, most people are now familiar with NLP or Neuro Linguistic Programming, which is a science that describes the three main sensory modalities, which are auditory, kinesthetic, and visual. And so our process involves all three of those and it synchronizes the visual component with the auditory component with the kinesthetic component. And basically what it does is it, it uh, it gets rid of or that part of the mind that's always looking for um, uh, either threats or novelty. If you give it what it wants, if you give it safety and security and you give it sensory resonance to where everything that it's experiencing adds up and makes sense and fits the picture, that part of the, mi the mind will move out of the way and instantly the mind will go to higher states, feelings of peace and well-being and connectedness and that everything's okay. Mr. Estes will now show us an example of the therapy's visual component. 
we have a technology that we're able to actually create a visual picture of the sine wave and the cosine wave using uh, standard engineering terms. And I'll put it over here on this computer screen so you can see it. So this we call a spectral essence matrix of a human being where each one of those pixels there is one of the frequencies out of the person's voice. And it's spread out there according to its sine wave and its cosine wave coefficients. And the color of each one of those pixels is its phase. And as you're watching this, as you're looking at this and watching it, the computer actually is disassembling that and reassembling it at every possible combination. So as a person sits and watches this for a few minutes, they basically see themselves taken apart and reassembled into every possible combination that they can be with what they already have. This would be the color therapy or the visual aspect of the technology. After these messages, we'll see a brief demonstration of a harmonic resolution therapy session. Please stay tuned to Supreme Master Television. You again are laying down on a warm liquid table that allows you to feel the vibrations of the sounds run through your body. What I do here is basically 180 degrees out of phase with the typical healing paradigm because that typical healing paradigm says let's find what's wrong and fix it. I find what's right and try to enhance it rather than find what's wrong and trying to fix it. Welcome back to Science and Spirituality. Don Estes, founder of InnerSense Incorporated, draws on the vibrational structure of the universe to help his clients realize their full potential. Mr. Estes invited our Supreme Master Television correspondent to try the equipment used in harmonic resolution therapy. Okay, have a step into the therapy room. This is the Vibrasound system. And you see it's a fluid transducer, so it basically turns your body fluid into a speaker as you lie down on okay. it. So if you'll slip your shoes off and then lie down with your head at that end. It's nice and warm. <laughs> yes, the table is heated. This little guy just floats right there. Okay. He has a little transducer in him as well. Yeah. And uh, I'm just gonna put a little cover over your feet. You'll notice the screen's floating above your head. You're gonna start out with your eyes open watching the screen. Okay. And if we had done the therapy on you, you would actually be seeing those, those mandalas and stuff here on this. I'm just gonna show you a little bit of a video now. Okay. You'll start out with your eyes open. Um, I'm just gonna run that for like three minutes. And then the screen's gonna go blank like it looks right now. Mm -hmm. And then when that happens, I wanna ask you to put these glasses on. What happens is it has little light diodes in it, mm -hmm. and it actually plays the frequencies of the music onto the closed eyelid, and it turns on the screen that you use when you're dreaming. Okay, so we've just put a person on the system. I've turned the system on, I've explained to them uh, all the particulars of what they need to be doing during the session and um, I will be participating with them. I'll be watching them and listening to them, and uh, I'll be changing music for them. I'll be uh, fading back and forth between one piece of music and another piece of music, and if they had a voice analysis, I would be fitting that into the process as well. So this will go for about uh, 40 minutes, and then we'll give them a few minutes to integrate, and then I'll go in and get them and bring them back out, and then we'll discuss what it was that they experienced back there. As we learned last week, Mr. Estes uses water that's been through a special process as a key component in effecting constructive change in those who experience harmonic resolution therapy. The creation of the water, called transformant, mirrors the therapy that clients undergo as the water is asked to transform itself and reach a higher level. 
What we do is we can take a person's voice and then we can split that into actual and imaginary potential and put it into these two gold rods and ask the water here to do the same thing that we're asking the person to do to resolve the difference between those two signals. And what happens is for about an hour, the water just puts up resistance just like a human being does and says, no, I'm not going to do that. But we keep asking and keep asking and keep asking that finally the water reaches some kind of threshold where it gives up all the resistance to the change and it begins to cavitate and implode inward on itself. And it implodes, creates a tremendous amount of heat, vaporizes itself, and vapor tries to rise up and leave the planet. But up here in this condenser, we capture that and we solidify it back down into a liquid. And over here, we bottle it. When a person actually drinks this water, they get the resources that they need for the transformation to the next highest level of order. For the water, that's from physical liquid into a vapor essence. For a human being, it would be from a physical, material, evolutionary creature into an existential, spiritual essence. I can't ask the person to take that whole journey in one session with me, but I can ask the water to do it, and I can push it across the veil to where it basically dies and passes over to the other side, but I resurrect it and pull it back, and it remembers the essence of that journey, how to acknowledge the need for change, how to give up the resistance to the change, how to remove the unwholesomeness and purify itself and go to its next level of order. So. Uh, this part of our process actually adds into the other process as to providing dedicated support for somebody going through the harmonic resolution process. We sincerely thank Mr. Don Estes for his pioneering work using the science of vibration for human transformation. Let's all soon reach our highest potential. For more information on Don Estes, please visit www.vibrasound.com. Thank you, Tranquil viewers, for joining us on this edition of Science and Spirituality. Up next is Words of Wisdom after Noteworthy News. May all beings on our planet be in harmony with the universe. For more details, please visit www.suprememastertv.com forward slash ss.